Hi and welcome students. In this Microsoft Excel 2016 tutorial, I'm going to show you how to change page orientation and page size. Let's get started. So the first way that I'm going to do this is show you what it is currently set up as default. If you go to the File tab, Print button, you'll see that by default the page size is 8.5 by 11, meaning 8.5 inches wide by 11 inches tall. This is your standard letter size paper. Next, you'll also notice that it is, it is in uh, portrait orientation, which is taller rather than it is wide. The first way that we could change the orientation is by going to the page layout tab, which is right here, the page setup group, and then if you go right here to orientation, you can switch it from portrait to landscape. And that's one way to do it. Another way to do it is by going to the file tab, print button, and changing it right here from landscape to portrait or portrait to landscape. Either one works fine, it just depends on what you're doing. On something that has a little bit wider of a table, like this one, landscape is probably better because it could fit everything within the page. Next I'm going to show you how to change your page size. Page size is also in the page layout tab and it's also in the page setup group. It's right here where it says size. By default it'll be 8.5 by 11 which is your standard letter size paper, but if you're using a longer sheet like legal, you can click there to change it to legal. Or you can even click on size and make it an envelope size. Really whatever you're doing inside of Excel, it has an option for it. If you want to see all of your options, you can click right down here on more paper sizes, and then you can view from a list of sizes that are included within this menu as well. Next, I'm going to go into the print uh, area in the file tab, go to print, and you can also see that you can change your size right in here. I currently have it as legal, and you can see the extra inches on the right side now. I could turn it back to letter. I could also change it to an envelope. I'll just choose one of these envelope options and you can see how it affects the actual page itself. So this is an easy way to tell if all of your content actually will fit on the page by changing the paper size or the orientation. And, that you, and then you will see exactly how it will look when it's printed. So hopefully this video has helped you out. If it has, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to the channel. If you have any questions, please put them in the comment section below and I'll do my best to respond to you. Um, if you have any, or, uh, other than that, I guess thanks for watching and have a great rest of your day.